Welcome to another session. Uh, in today's session, we will be deploying Postgres, which is a database on uh, Railway app. And uh, we will be testing the deployment uh, using PHP MyAdmin. Uh, so I'm actually here. I'll just say create and then select a database and then I'll do a Postgres database. It is spinning up uh, deployments over here. And then uh, I'll open PG my admin to test this. So this PG admin for and the database that I've just deployed is Postgres. It takes about a minute. So it's uh, still deploying. Uh, so on here, I'll uh, register a new server which is uh, of course the server that is on railway. You can give it um, a name and then here on the connection, you have to get the connection from uh, Postgres from uh, railway app. So just uh, look at the public public uh, networking. You can use this URL. As the host name or the address, and then you need to change the port. This is uh, a really important part. If you'll be connecting to it uh, locally, you need to use this port that is uh, provided here which will ideally map to 5432, which is the default port for Postgres. And then you have to provide the password. I'll just uh, check the variables and then PG password here, I'll just copy it. And uh, put it there and then I'll try to connect to it and uh, it has successfully connected so we have one database by default so here you can like ideally create a database and uh, add tables So this is your database that you've created. Uh, you can do more with it. So there are no tables. I'm trying to I'm just trying to create a, a, a table And then uh, there you have the table I has created on the database that you've just uh, deployed. 
and uh, you can try to maybe do some select statement it's quite fast and you can see it's fetching